today my goal was to accomplish a skill that I have never even gotten close to accomplishing. And after, as I looked through all of my wants and hopes, I found Blender, a VFX slash animation slash modeling software that I have always wanted to know how to use. However, it is incredibly complicated and takes people years to master. So in today's video, I'm just going to be taking a small dive into the basics of Blender and trying to learn it in five days. Anyways, let's get started. So I started with this video and it was an awesome video. I know just enough about Blender from previous experience while trying to learn about it that I was able to at least start keyframing. And so that was definitely very helpful. I watched a couple other videos and then I felt ready to go in and start actually making something worthy of publishing. And here's what I got. What you just saw there was the beginning. Anyways, I'm gonna continue watching tutorials and learning. So now I'm gonna be messing around with actual characters and more animation and actually making things in Blender. So let's get started. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the premiere of, uh, what's it called? 0001-013.mkv, uh, the, world's greatest animated movie critically uh, it's it's just perfect in every way so uh, everybody sit down silence your phones and get ready to watch this chicken jockey chicken jockey Thank you all for coming. I don't know if you could tell, but that was that was my first piece. Yeah, I've never really done animating before, but yeah, I hope you all liked it. Bye-bye. So there you have it, my first real animated piece. And now I'm realizing that Blender is actually really difficult, way more than I had imagined before. And also there's so much creative power that comes with it once you actually learn it. And then I did something extraordinary that I bet if you're watching this video and you're at least slightly into Blender, you've probably done this. I made a donut. And now after approximately eight hours of neglecting everyone in my life for Blender, I finally got my first real results. An advertisement for a company that needs a better ad manager but you know it's fine so let's just watch the video little boy fix your posture right now or we are going to have a problem use the posture trainer no nah i'm gonna get you trainer max. that's why i use posture trainer max that's why i use posture trainer max it is now day three and I'm halfway through this challenge. I have officially not made a ton of progress, but in five days it's honestly pretty good for something as complex as Blender. Now, I don't even want to talk about how long it took me to actually make that donut, but the past is in the past now, and so I'm going to be trying to make a couch model now. Now I'm starting to realize we have a problem on hand. Well, you see, we're running out of time and I'm still not making beautiful animations. I'm not sure what we're gonna do, but we've gotta hurry up and finish this project. Yeah, so it was after this moment that I realized I need to lock in, so guess what I did? I spent a couple hours working on a cabin project and didn't even get a render out of it before the end of day five. Anyways, while well, it came to a disappointing close, I think it was a really good example of really learning Blender and how difficult it is. I highly suggest you go learn Blender. It was awesome and I would totally do it again. And uh, super good skill. Anyways, uh, go have a good day. Bye bye. Subscribe the swing. Breathe in and out. Each tick brings you deeper into curiosity. You like thoughtful takes, clever reviews. You enjoy being ahead. 